Good evening. Welcome back to Chocolocker Park here in Oxford, Alabama. As we are in week two of your Alabama Park and Rec State Baseball Championships, uh, we are hosting the ages of 7, 8, 9, and 10 U. Uh, this hour we have with us the 9 U Rock Creek coach, Coach Justin. Coach, thank you for your time. Thank you for sitting in with us and appreciate what you do for the game of baseball. Uh, coach, uh, you coming out of Region 5, played some region play uh, a couple weeks ago, had a week to get back on the field, practice, get get things uh, ironed out, get ready for the state championship. Tell us what you what you uh, you did on the practice field with the guys last week and what you're expecting out of them this week. Uh, really, truly, we uh, we struggled really hard getting the bats going. Uh, pitching was phenomenal. Uh, had a 65% strike ratio throughout the whole regional. So uh, that aspect of the game, they were phenomenal. Uh, Defensive-wise, they played great ball. Um, we just couldn't get the bats going. So we've spent the past two weeks um, swinging, swinging the wood, swinging the wood. Don't stop swinging the wood. You gotta, if you want to win it, you got to swing to get there. You, you can't go up there and try and walk your way to a championship. So uh, just, just swung the bat a bunch. Yes, sir. Well, uh, you know, part of these interviews is always always great to hear coaches' philosophy, but sometimes coaches, it's great to hear uh, the guys that you brought up to sit alongside you today. And, and tell me a little bit about these two guys and why you brought them up. Um, to my direct right, it's Brody Hudson. Um, he is uh, my assistant coach's son. He's uh, pretty he, he's, he's pretty much going to be the solidification of an ace on the pitching roster. Um, kid throws a, a pretty mean little knuckleball uh, that, uh, that is phenomenal. Uh, does a really good third base, first base, wherever I need him to go, and then he's probably one of the best catchers um, at our whole ballpark. Uh, and then directly to his right is my son. Uh, he is uh, he's referred to as Big Dog on, on, on from his buddy. He carries a pretty big stick, swinging a 30-22 uh, drop eight nine years old, swinging at eight, year, eight years old, um, plays anywhere on the ball field, but uh, got a pretty good little knuckle curve, so, uh, and then uh, just all around one of my more consistent bats. He's a, he's a big swinger. He wants to hit the ball and not watch it, so uh, that's, that's him. Yeah. Well, Coach, uh, sounds to me like with Balin and Brody, we got a, got a set here, a killer beat, so <laughs> we hope that you guys do a great job. Balin, Brody, uh, answer a couple things for us so that uh, everybody back home in, in the Oxford area here, anybody that's watching can understand and get to know you. You guys got a favorite baseball team? Mm-hmm. They like the Blaves. How about you? I'll say the Eagle Padres. Okay. Well, Padre action all, all the way out there on the coast. Um, favorite baseball player? Tatis. Tatis. Oh, man, he's a great player, guys. Got a good one there. Um, we were talking a little bit before we did this interview. This is this is kind of interesting. Who's your favorite college football team? Alabama. Alabama. Yeah, think about it, Dean. <laughs> Who's yours? Auburn. Auburn. How do you guys get along? Mm-hmm. Totally baseball Who's a better baseball player? <laughs> Which one of you is a better baseball player? <laughs> I don't know. Well, we, can't, I ask, we can't say that. <laughs> Man, that, that's uh, that's something else. Well, either one of you got a girlfriend? I do. What's her name? Didn't you say Lakin? Something like that. Lakin Barnett. Lakin Barnett. Barnett. Okay. Well, we're going to ask her next time we do an interview who the better baseball player is. Okay. Okay. Right. Hey, Coach. Uh, we hope you have a lot of fun this week. Uh, next couple of days, we hope you have success, and, and we hope. Boys get a lot out of it. But in the meantime, you got some downtime here. Uh, we we ask you highly consider big time entertainment as they will be up the road providing entertainment, laser tag, bowling, uh, arcades, go kart, things like that. And they have offered a kind, uh, generous 25% discount to our teens and families. So, hey guys, one last time as we head out, our community's watching the video. Let's give them a, a big go, Eagles, okay? One, two, three. Go, go Eagles! Eagles! Thank you.